Hey guys, so uh, a bit more gameplay footage here again. It's four player co op. I'm using the uh, level 11 Demon Hunter this time. Uh, we are somewhere with a level 13 monk, a level 8 wizard, and a level 10 wizard. Um, so, again, we're going to do the same thing. Um, the Skeleton King run uh, just started at the uh, at Tristram. We're in the Lyric Passage now, or the Cathedral, level 2. Um, so once again, it's literally just a race to try and find the uh, next level, as quick as you can. So the main abilities I've got for my Demon Hunter are, I've got the Bowler Shot, which hits people and explodes. Oh god. Uh, we've got Rapid Fire, which I understand from a, a hatred point of view, you're better off um, the rapid there. using it all out and then uh, rebuilding your hatred. I think it costs less the more you use it, or the initial blast costs more, so you're better to use it and keep using it than anything else. Um, we've got the Vault ability that conceals us and speeds us up. And we've got an ability that lets us disappear from sight, which we'll see shortly, I think. Yeah, so like that, we can just run away and then bring our rapid fire up. Um... Did we not kill them? No, I think we've come the wrong way. Leather pants of the hawk. I didn't realize hawks wore pants, but there we go. Um, so again, we uh, just... Oh, there we go. So somebody's found the uh, next level up there. So, quickest way. Walk back to town. Wait for the objective to change. Oh, sorry, it warps to where they are. You can decide to save yourself having a save yourself a loaded screen, but uh, what are you gonna do? Okay, so the uh, the rune we've got on our uh, abilities is that whenever we use them, it increases our movement speed by 60% for two seconds after. So, um, it's worth doing. Sorry, I say worth doing. What I mean is it's worth, rather than spamming it, do it. If you want to you know, get the most out of it, do your vault, run for a little while, and then spam it again. And that's, I guess, to get the most bonus for movement out of doing it. Uh, normally, the only reason why I'm bothering to fight anything is because I'm only level 11, so I'm trying to get as much XP out of this run as I can, whilst maximising its. Well, trying to keep it as quick as I can. Um. Black magic bars our way. Well, there we go. But the way is Templar is stronger. Let's get our hatred up a little bit. Okay, so just go and stab him. There we go. The other stuff. Oops, missed the door. <laughs> Ironically, making it longer. Making it take longer anyway. Just fill up my hatred. Oh! Ready for me to do that? Let's see what we're going to have unlocked. Oh, so we've unlocked an ability called Chakram. Let's try that out for a laugh. And we've got. 
a rune for our caltrops, but we don't use caltrops, so we're going to ignore them. So let's carry on. I don't know what that does. Can't work out if that's better than rapid fire or not. I'm going to expect not, because rapid fire is pretty good. Oh, that's not bad, he threw in a, threw in a nice circular pack. Now this is a, a fun room. You come for this resplendent chest which then hides in the floor and pops up these towers that spawn skeletons. Uh, I don't know why this is... I don't know if you have to be in proximity of the other players to make the... Uh, game a bit harder, but uh... Let's try and take out this tower, otherwise they're going to keep spawning. I can't remember if I like that or not. Some lucky leather pants of the lion. Okay, so I'll just keep on exploring. Pretty certain I've come the wrong way. Okay, so we might be in a spot of bother here. So you see these monsters have got nightmarish, which is annoying, because that's the thing that makes you run away. And you lose control of your character temporarily. I'm well again. Good. I, I was very much concerned. Oh good, someone's found the crypt, so we can just click accept. God damn, someone's done a huge amount of work while I've just been pansying about doing nothing. <clears throat> but that's the way of it, really. Sometimes you'll get there quite quickly, sometimes you'll have to spend some time running about. So hopefully all ten players will stay this time and we can, um, we can see what four-player co-op on the uh, Skeleton King looks like. As you can see, not hugely different from three-player. I really don't think I like that ability. Let's just switch back to rapid fire. So again, because our hatred's full, we're going to just empty it with rapid fire. Should move, I should move, I should move. Fill it back up with our bowler shots. And then empty it with rapid fire. If I can aim. I don't normally do ranged attacks for games like this. But there was a, a meteor on level on uh, Diablo 2 and that went pretty well. That incidentally is why I take the time to kill the um, skeletons, because I never quite know if he's going to teleport and beat the shit out of me or not, so uh, I think it's nice to have a good amount of health about just in case. I 
and that's it. So 5,250 XP. Uh, you get better drops, I think with that as with all Diablos, you get better drop the first time you do it. Um, and so that's it, so that's a full player co-op run of the hardest part of the game. Um, yeah, so uh, it's as hard as this beta gets. So that was with a level 10, oh, level 11, 11 and level 12 uh, Demon Hunter. Dexterity. Uh, yeah, I'll keep those because they're better for once I've. Uh... Thing is, I'm trying to keep uh, equipment that maximizes my That's experience to level up quicker. Uh, but I think it's worth keeping some other better equipment for once you've hit level 13 if you're going to play any more. So, um, yeah, it's Demon Hunter run. I might do a bit more. I might do another run of a another character. I'm not going to do the Barbarian because they're already level 13. I might do a Witch Doctor. But anyway, I hope you've enjoyed that and I'll see you later. Hey guys, that's right. So, you guessed it, we're in for another Skeleton King run this time. I'm. Oh, I don't know if my game's buggered, I can't interact with anything. Oh no, there we go. Um, I've got very high latency though, so I don't know what game I'm connected to. Uh, so, as you can see, we've got uh, our. Why is all this down here? Oh, yeah, I was trying to. Max I've got decent equipment and I've got. Uh, Experience gathered equipment. So we're with our. Oops. So we're the demon hunter this time. I've warped to a person who's gone the wrong way. Oh, sorry, not a demon hunter. A. Uh, what's it called? This guy, witch doctor. So the abilities we've got we've got summon zombie dogs, we've got soul harvest. Um, we are very laggy. Oh, my latency's gone down a bit, that's better. So I've walked back to town yet, I'm still looking at a cave. Because I'm lagging a bit, which is a shame. So we want to be in Cathedral level 2, there we go. So we've got the blow dart, or the poison dart, with three um, darts for our primary, our primary ability. We've got three zombie dogs. Uh, we've got the fire bats for our secondary mouse ability. Who are we? So we looks like we're with a wizard and a barbarian. Which is good. I really, really like the other barbarian. It feels very brutal. Pat yourself on the back, why don't you? I think this is probably the wrong way, but uh, hey hell. Run well, up, this is the right way. But it's not going to be easy. Oh right, okay, that's interesting. I'll get fucked here. I personally, I'm not a fan of the Witch Doctor. I don't think I play it very well. And I don't really enjoy it. But um, nonetheless, I thought I should bring some different kinds of gameplay. Uh, so this is only level 9 though, so maybe that's why. Maybe I need to just do a bit of a bit of leveling for him. I mean, that thing's brutal, that fire bats. I think the other thing is that again I haven't I think it's uh, intelligence that uh does damage for witch doctors and I haven't really um tried to maximise that this time either, so uh oops a rare monster in here. I don't know if uh, like skeletons and undead monsters take uh, too much damage from poison, but there we go. Uh, so you probably see I am lagging quite a lot. Um, I don't think that's me. I don't know if that's the service getting busy again or. Oh dear. This is ridiculously laggy. But anyway, we'll play on. Hopefully, it'll get a bit better.
So who are we with? A demon hunter, a wizard, and a barbarian. So we've got quite a nice balance this time around. Oh, there you go. No more latencies. Just jump back up. So, uh, not sure what the deal is. Okay, so we're about to go and fight John Dar. Need 4,000 XP to level up. We need 8,000 XP to level up. Alright, so just bash space to get through the dialogue. Stab him. Templar man. Good stuff. Thank you for your aid. I will go with you on your hunt for the skeleton. Yeah, intelligence we primary attribute which increases all damage, so that's we should probably swap some armor for some intelligence. Come on then. So I'm the lowest level on this server. Um, so a lot of the guys are not carrying me, still doing enough damage. But between that and the lag, it's um, probably not the most valuable team member. Let's come looking. So you're really the the ideal thing for this is that you uh, stumble upon the uh, next level more or less straight away just to help keep the gameplay short obviously the quicker the gameplay the more you can get done the more you get done the more you get the more you get the better things are That looks great without the fire animation. Don't know why my latency is so high. Um, yeah. Hopefully it's going to be straight down from here. I've seen it be there a couple of times. Nope. Bastard. So we've come the wrong way. Is anybody closer to it? Nope, so everybody's come the wrong way. <laughs> I've come even more the wrong way looking at my map. Where could it be? Uh, oh, is it going to be there? I don't even know which one I am anymore. Oh, there I am. Um, yeah, don't like the witch doctor. I don't know why people aren't exploring here. Maybe they've already been this way and it's a dead end. It looks like a dead end. Typically these sorts of rooms are dead ends. But you never know. Yep, there you do. Hopefully we can get some uh Oh good, Anguish has found it. So we'll just kill these and then we'll run up and walk back to them.
See, it's weird. Whenever I play with somebody who's a witch doctor, they always do really well. I obviously just have a very bad witch doctor. So those guys have found the crypt, so we'll do what we always do. We'll walk back to town. We'll follow Anguish's banner. So laggy. I wonder where I'm actually going to end up after doing this. Is it even going to come back? Maybe it won't. No, I think we may have we may have lost our connection. We may have lagged out. Oh no, there we go. This is unplayable almost. I'm sorry, this is some terrible uh, gameplay. God, it's just every other time now, isn't it? <laughs> I think we'll come back when we get to the Skeleton King. Right guys, the um, this isn't going to fix itself, it hasn't come back, so I'm just going to quit this game and see if I can find a different one. If I can't, this will be all the gameplay, but you never know. Okay guys, so I've picked a different server. Still four player co-op, we've got a, a, a manageable ping now. Um, so we are... Just going to come back, do this fight, and then we'll be where we were. Wonderful. Uh, the thing that I think I should have been doing with the uh, Witch Doctor is um, there's an ability that makes monsters around you, or it drains their life to raise your intelligence, which obviously increases your damage output. So I think what I should have been doing is I should have been spamming that. But obviously, it wasn't. Go on, Barb, leap it. Barbarians can actually leap that gap, so maybe he just might have used his leap or something, but. Uh, XP, so we're, like I said, we're currently up to level 10. Um, <coughs> we're still using poison darts and fire bats and, fire and zombie dogs. So in we go to defeat the skeleton king. Again, still full play co op. We've got a monk, a barbarian, and I think a demon hunter. So uh, we're all different classes, which is nice. Now fight the skeleton king. Uh, one of our zombie dogs has died, so we'll just summon a, another round of them, as it were. Okay, so we'll just. Um, oh, so there go all our zombie dogs already. Traps like. Okay. So presumably that is the more monsters you have around you, the more increases your intelligence and subsequently your damage output, so Consequently, rather. Okay, so there we go. So that was a bit more gameplay and with the Witch Doctor. Uh, spanned across two different servers because of my 
wretched internet connection. Go have a quick look at what we've picked up. And uh, we'll leave it at that, I think. What do we have? So... An ally has gone, but my foes lose strength. So yeah, so nothing any good at all. <laughs> I've got some got a right good bunch of things for you this fine day. Oops, I just sold all my fallen teeth. We don't want to do that. We'll have them back. If anybody could tell me what that mushroom does, that'd be good. If I don't actually know. Just try and craft some equipment. So we want we need some shoulder pads. Whatever they're called. So we'll get some of these. See what they're like. So we can't put those up until level 11, I thought we were level 11, but 10 intelligence, so that's actually really good. Uh, helm's not too bad. Uh, we could do some better everything. <laughs> um, our braces, let's do one of these. See what they are. Vitality, extra gold. It's not very good. It's, uh, boots, uh, uh, boots aren't bad actually. Pants. Yeah, let's try some of these. It's probably the last thing we can craft. Six intelligence, five better, two XP. All right, we'll have them. We will salvage that. Okay, so that's that for now. We'll probably we may, I might do a little bit more gameplay with the Witch Doctor, but I think the server's going to go down quite soon, so maybe not. So thank you for watching. I hope you've enjoyed it. Hey guys, so a bit more gameplay with the Witch Doctor, another uh, Skeleton King run. I've just got my Witch Doctor to level uh, 11, and I've unlocked a bonus, uh, sorry, a, <coughs> a Plague of Toads attack. I don't know whether that's going to be any good or not. And a, um, so it places my Poison Dart, and I've unlocked a rune for my um, Fire Bats to make them better. Uh, so hopefully, I don't know whether these toads are a good idea on this. I'm assuming not. You know how that goes. A bit laggy again. Yeah, run toads. How many you can spam? It's ridiculous. Oh, I see. So the. Uh, the update to the fire bats, as you can see, is uh, larger and they do more damage, apparently. I'm not sure how much I contributed there. That's the level 11 witch doctor. Just went back to town. Um, don't think I like playing of tones. It's good that you can spam, but um, you've, I've kind of got this for. Uh, AoE, so I think for my first skill, I think the Poison Dart is probably better. Or I think it is anyway. So uh, yeah, so that's a bit more com. I might try and do another one or two runs before the server dies. I'm not sure. Okay guys, back again. This area should start looking pretty familiar for people now. Um, what I've done is I've gone... I've changed my weapon for my um, Witch Doctor, so I've <coughs> I've gone back to just having one um, Oh, I've gone two-handed rather, rather than one big staff. So, um, yeah, my attack speed's increased, which has made this um, the blowpipe attack a little bit more effective, I think, because <coughs> it attacks more frequently. Um, I don't think I don't know if the runes to increase the size of the bats is particularly better. I don't think I like it as much. But um, I'm having a hard time gauging the damage, so... It seems to run out of mana very quickly, which um, frustrates me a little bit. I think it's why I prefer classes that can keep spamming and ability at least. Um, but I don't know. So I've gone for a lower DPS and a higher intelligence. I'm hoping that's what I'm supposed to do. I don't know. I 
don't think charging into melee is a good idea, but there we go. Sorry if the game's a little bit laggy, I've uploaded a video to YouTube and um, currently processed another video as I'm playing, so uh, may jerk a little bit. My dogs are surviving. Oh, no, there they go. Oh no, they're not, they're good. Interesting. Okay. So do we get a short staff of slaughter? That's two handed again, so we're not too keen on that. Right, yeah, so meh, this is kinda what the game turns into when you get high level characters. Um yeah. There you guys, a bit more um four player carp gameplay. Again another Skeleton King run. I'm still a little bit laggy, I'm not quite sure why. I think it's because I'm still uploading. So I'm hoping I'm gonna finish by now. Oops. <clears throat> so I'm a little bit behind the gameplay, but I'm trying, I'm trying. So we're back with our demon hunter. Don't think I like the witch doctor. Love the barbarian. I've got a level 13 barbarian, so I haven't bothered showing you any footage of it. God. But very much like it. Um. It's just, it feels so brutal. I don't know. It's good stuff. I really like it. Uh, look at this. Look at I love it. I just love it. Right, that guy hasn't got the greatest barbarian, but uh, still. So we're a level 12 uh, Who are you? demon hunter. We're not too far away from, well we are, we're an entire level away from 13. So we were not going to go up in this particular video, I don't think, but uh... Down this way. Let the barbarian do it then. I've got to do this to move a bit quicker. It's not a particularly sporting class, this one, when you're always running off in front of people. Black magic bars our way. But the way you wouldn't have to play like that, I guess. That's just how I'm choosing to do it. I don't know what that giant thing is that the monk keeps using. I have, I've deliberately not played a monk. Staying away from it because it's a class I want to be when the game comes out proper. But I don't know what uh, I don't know what it is that it keeps doing. Thank you for your Okay, so we have two barbs and a monk, we've got very much a, a physical type uh, posse going on here. Posse, parties, oops, crazy. That's the word I was looking for. Oh, not back. Uh, Demon Hunter's grown on me a little bit. I'd still prefer a nice big... I mean, like, look at that. I still prefer the Barbarian or something that can just wade in and, and smash stuff about. I think that's one of the best ways of playing this game so far. Certainly the demo. Ooh. Where's it gone? What have we got? Uh, some rubbish stuff, but anyway. <clears throat> oh, don't run out there. Oh, that was bad. 
Oh, someone's found the crypt, so we'll just kill these and then we'll walk back to town. My hatred is too low. Okay. <clears throat> so we'll walk back to town, then we'll portal to wherever the guys in the royal crypts are. Think of it, wonderful. Uh, you don't actually have to fight this bit. As if I've said that already, you, you can just run straight past it if you want. But uh, it can be quite handy if you have a, a barbarian in your party because no one's done it yet. Every time I've played, everybody's got the jump wrong. But barbarians can jump that gap. Um, so if you're the barbarian, it can be quite handy to just, uh, for the sake of getting through it quicker, to just run off and uh, do the jump. <coughs> and get straight to this door. Uh, and then trigger the next part of the quest with the skeleton king. So see if everybody accepts it. Yep, there we go. So every, the thing is, you can finish the, the beta uh, solo in it <coughs> about level 8, level 9 uh, without any real repetition or difficulty particularly. Um, so anybody who's above that has probably already done the story and is purely here to grind XP or items. And as you can see, no items whatsoever so far. Um, I saw a video about people doing amulet runs on this. I don't know if this is a particular point where they drop or anything like that. I've never had anything like that. I've probably killed the Skeleton King about, I don't know, ten times maybe? Uh, with the various um, actual story plays and these sort of grinding missions for different classes. See, being the ranged character in a melee party is uh, uh, pretty easy, really. So we have a nice big tank, we have several tanks in this instance. We'll just absorb all the damage for us. There we go. 